Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Rumble Stiltskin, and uh, you know today's video is a little bit different than normal. But um, you know I did an unboxing video on the Avenger controller, and I did a review on it. And there's been a lot of interest in it. And, you know, a lot of my friends ask me, Rumble, do you really play with that thing? That that thing looks crazy. So, I, you know, I keep telling them, yeah, I really do play with it. So, I thought, heck, why not make a video um, showing my hands playing with the Avenger controller, and um, see if I could get a good gameplay. So. This uh, gameplay fit the bill. I did, got it after, you know, I took one or two tries trying to get a good game and figuring out how to, sh how to show my hands the best. But, you know, it was a little difficult. It's maybe not the best angle. And, um, you know, if there's more interest on this, I can show some maybe different angles or something. But, um, yeah, so let's get into it. This gameplay is Hardcore Kill Confirmed. That's my favorite game type. And I just recently reset my Master Prestige. I don't know why, so... I'm kind of just using, I've been using this, um, I don't even know what this is, is this the Type 25? I've been using this for a while and I've just been rolling with it, but I think for this game, you know, I'm going to I'm gonna be half talking about, uh, you know, the gameplay itself and, you know, kind of half showing things with the Avenger controller that, um, that you can do that you normally wouldn't be able to do without it, so, you know, I'm picking up some tags here, I've already got it, my, my score streaks, I think I'm running Care Package, um, Let's see, Hellstorm and Lightning Strike. Those are my favorite. That's that's my favorite combo. I think um, if you put on if you put on Hardline, you can get you can get those pretty easy. And you know, I, I you know I'm, I got to admit I've never gotten a swarm, and you know I've never actually really tried. I I would much rather get you know three four Lightning Strikes in a game than than spend my whole game trying to get one swarm. You know, I don't know. That's just the way I am, but. Now this is hardcore, and you can see right here that I that I kill a teammate, so that's my bad. But um, I, I think I somehow I actually kill more than three teammates, and I don't I don't get kicked. But um, we'll, we'll try to keep a tally on that. It's collateral damage, you know, it just happens. Also, many of you may not know what the Avenger controller is, but obviously it's that thing on my controller, and you know. You might ask yourself, what's it supposed to do? Well, it's got these two little crazy arms that come off of your your square button and your triangle button and another one that comes off of your circle. And that's supposed to allow you to never take your thumbs off the thumbsticks um, while reloading and switching weapons and, and doing melee if, if you're on tactical layout. Um, I am on tactical layout, so, you know, circle is my melee. So that's pretty nice. I, I don't think I melee anybody in this game, but I, I have another one that I, that I get a few melee kills in to kind of show you guys how the knife works, and maybe maybe that'll be in a different video. But as you can see, for the most part, my thumbs are on the sticks all the time, and you know that that's really good for your control and your aim. Although I, it's funny watching this now. Just just now, you know, when I've been making this video, I'm watching it, and I let go of my thumbsticks quite often. I don't know why, I just let it snap back to center or something, so... I, I never really realized that I did that, and it was kind of funny trying to play this game and, you know, keep keep my hands in the frame of the video, and I, I was thinking about my hands too much, so there's a few times where I, where I totally derped it and, um, you know, didn't get the kill, but we'll see those coming up, but... I just thought I'd point out what the what the Avenger is, and if you guys haven't seen my other videos, I encourage you to check them out. I did an unboxing and you know another review, and the, some people found those pretty helpful. So I just thought I'd remind you guys about that. So coming up is a sequence um, that I think really shows the off the Avenger controller pretty well. Um, I go down this hallway and I get two kills off a guy, and then I hurry and swap to my secondary without taking my thumbstick off. So watch that. So I get this one get this two and watch my finger I bump it bump that lever and I didn't have to take my thumb off the stick however I didn't get the kill because you know that doesn't help if your aim is shit so it's kinda hard to see in this but um my my trigger fingers are actually my middle fingers and they they're on the lower triggers of the PlayStation um, controller but on Xbox that you know I think the, the triggers and aim down side are on the lower triggers anyways but you would have to set this up in your game options with um, 
you'd have to flip the trigger buttons in your in your settings. Now I've I've gotten a lot of questions if this works for Battlefield, and I I don't know to be honest. You know I haven't played Battlefield that much. I I have it, but I haven't played it. So you would have to definitely check to see if you have that option to to flip the triggers. And if if it's the same setup on Xbox, then and you don't need to flip them, then it might it, I'm sure it will work for it. So that's just something to keep in mind. There's two little um, hoops that my my fingers go through that are that are attached. You can kind of see it right there, and um, you know that's that's just how how it works. So now this is a pretty good sequence. I clean these two guys up, and I heard a shotgun behind me. Got him, and they're shooting at me again, throwing grenades. Now keep in mind this is hardcore. I'm on the brink of death, and I picked that guy up, oh, and that guy popped up behind him. So he's got a bloodthirsty right there. Maybe even more. I don't know, but. So yeah, that was, that was a little spot where I derped it right there that I was kind of talking about. There's another one coming up, but oh well. So another question that I get asked a lot, you know, is is how long does it take to get used to this thing? Is it hard to get used to? And you know, it doesn't really take that long. Um, for me, it probably took like a good solid hour with it, really trying. You know, I, I, I went into like a, a, what do they call it, combat training. I went into combat training and tried it out first, you know, before I went to public lobbies, but it didn't take that long, and now, I'm, as you can see, I'm used to it, I can I can usually do do pretty well with it, so this is another another um, sequence where, you know, the Avenger controller really helps out, so I'm going to get this care package, I saw that guy, and I don't know why I did this, but I picked it up, and I swapped weapons again, and I um, didn't have to take my thumbs off the sticks, and that's... You know, again, that's just reinforcing the idea of what the Avenger controller is is meant to do. And um, you know, I I really like it. I I find it helpful. I don't know why I blew that up just there. I don't know why. <laughs> kind of ridiculous, but um, yeah. So next, I think I should probably talk about the scuff controllers. Now, I don't have a scuff controller, but I know that they're designed to mainly do this same thing. Um, scuff controllers take basically a stock controller, a factory controller, and add some paddles on the bottom of the controller that um, gives you that extra functionality of the buttons. And This is basically doing the same thing, just in a different way, but um, I would really like to try a scuff out myself. I know they have the, the scuff animal where um, there's four paddles on the bottom, and I think that, that could be really sweet. But and I don't know if you guys noticed that, but that guy was trying to pick up my care package, and he he changed it to an AGR and then he died for me so that was really nice of him. I, I'd like to thank him for giving me that AGR while trying to steal my package and being a douchebag. That sounds really bad actually trying to steal my package but oh well. So right now I'm just waiting for my care package or my AGR to come in and um, decided to control this one. We only got a few minutes left in the game so I thought see what fun I can have in this. I normally don't control it myself thought I was getting shot at right when I hopped in this thing so I, I checked it out I saw I was still there so I normally don't control this myself but um it feels like when I when I don't um it gets it gets taken out so fast with EMP grenades there's so much EMP spam it, I mean it can just drive you nuts it feels like those EMPs land you know across the map and they still affect you and, and uh so I decided, you know, I'll, I'll take this one in my own hands and I'll try to get as many kills as I can. I only get a couple before, boom, right there, EMP grenade. It's done. This should be able to sustain, like, two e EMP grenades for a higher score streak. But, oh well, I don't make the games. I just play them and complain about them. So, um, that's it, though, guys. This gameplay is about coming to an end. Um, you know, if you have any comments or questions, please uh, leave a comment below. And you know I'll, I'll get to as many as I can. I, I usually read them all and and uh, reply to most of them. So if you have any questions, just uh, leave a comment. I'll get to you. And um, you know if you like the video, press like. That would really help me out. And uh, tell your friends, whatever. But um, peace out, guys. That's it. Um, I'm Rumble Stiltskin. I'm gonna pick up the final two kills here. But heartbreaker here. We lost the match. But oh well. Uh, it was a good game. Um, Mainly the video was, was to show you guys this controller, so I'm going to put some videos up on the on the screen here at the end um, that you can check out, and if you want to, you can do that. If not, uh, peace out. I'll see you next time.